Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here, and thank you all so much for tuning back into The Walking Dead. This is part one of episode three. If you have not seen the previous parts, then do be sure and watch the episode one, part one, that is linked down below in the video description, or tune into the playlist on the channel. Now, without further ado, let's get to it. National Guard orders evacuation of city, the Macon Herald. Okay, so we're still local. Between episodes, we didn't go very far. It looks like, uh, found some backpacks. <laughs> Guns. Guns are good. Did we make it back to the pharmacy or? The long road ahead. There we go. Looks like we're gonna do some traveling like in this, this episode. Looks like this is our lucky day. Let's be positive. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. <laughs> right. I don't know what happened last time, but it doesn't sound good. This place looks terrible. Looks like everything has been already been taken. And then the walkers show up. Pop right out of that window. Man. You made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. The ocean does sound like a good plan. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Hmm. I probably will. What? Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. <laughs> we didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. True. Why is there a plane inside the pharmacy? I don't understand. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. <laughs> I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No Point. kidding. See if we can climb this. It's probably about to fall off. Yep. It's gone. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Okay. The truck would be kind of awesome. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Hmm. She'll be fine. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. Makes sense. I don't understand what the winch is for. What are we doing? What are we gonna do? He's just doing stuff. I don't even know what's going on right now. <laughs> are we about to winch the truck over? Or what? Oh, winch control. Okay, I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the winch control, it will um, pull the truck over. Nice. The girl still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week. I hope not. Hoping ain't worth a damn. Hope is a powerful tool, Kenny. You should know that. Keeps people alive. Keeps the morale up. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Hmm. It was a scary situation for him. Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. Hmm. That's a good point. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Shit! <laughs> Just drop me, man. Walkers. Jesus. Are you okay? No, Dick. I'm shocked. No, get off here. Person. Go save her. Help me! Go save her, go save her, go save her. 
Hurry! Oh Somebody crap, there's more than one. Me. Stop yelling like a crazy person! What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Shoot, then everything up. Pretty sure she just got bit. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. You can't. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. That's terrible. We, we can't do that. No, we gotta put her out of her misery. We've got to do it. Yeah. Put her out of her misery. That, she was going to die and we couldn't get over to her. And now they're coming to me. God damn it. I couldn't just let her get eaten. It hurts to get a paper cut, let alone have somebody bite you to death. Now look what you did. Let's move. Well, get me up there and quit acting like a pansy. Come on now. Oh my goodness. Where's Glenn when you need him, right? Okay, they're coming for me. Close the door. There's gotta be another way out or something. Because I don't think we're gonna be able to push through a crowd of walkers. Great way to start the game. This time I was a little more decisive than the first, than the second Fuck. episode. Incoming. Come on, Lee! What is that? It's sturdy as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. We gotta grab everything. All right. We need medicine. There we go. And medicine. And medicine. And what is that? Medicine. Oh, that's supplies. And medicine. And supplies. That's food. Awesome. And grab this thing. Come on. Yes, we got it all. Awesome. Go over here. Grab it all, grab it all, grab it all, grab it all. Yeah, we're running out of time. Get the get the bandage in this thing right here. Grab it, yes. And, oh, our time's up. Your backpack has lots of supplies. There we go. Incoming. Come That's on, how Lee. we do. Now what? Up and over. Up and over, up and over, up and over. Let's hustle. Oh, no. Me. No. Okay. Jump, push, push up, bench press, bench press. This is why we spent all those years in the gym. Push, push, push. Where's Kenny? There he is. Kenny, come on, man. Did you seriously just consider not saving me? Are you kidding me now? Okay, now, now shoot him. Fridge, push over the fridge. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go, smash one, block the other. Perfect. Fucking get out. He considered not saving me. What a punk. Hello. How you doing? Punch him? Are we gonna punch him? Are we gonna... Why can't I do anything? Okay, there we go. For some reason, I wasn't getting the option. Come on. Come on. There we go. Ah. No. <laughs> Get away from me. Oh, there you go. Stab him up against the wall. That works. Found some metal. That's a poor dude. He was a military man. He was a good man. Or a woman. Fuck, kind of hard that? to tell. They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? We need to work together better, man. We need to work through this. This is not how it's supposed to go. You saved me, I saved you. No ifs, ands, or buffs. No checks and balances. It just, you do. You just do what you gotta do. That's what you do. Uh, I'm disappointed in Kenny. He should have probably just jumped. In. Why are there arrows in my door? In my walls? In the walls? In the gate? Apparently the bandits don't like me either now. I guess because we killed the people that were providing them with food, huh? Good job being on guard, buddy. Clementine talking to her walkie-talkie. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. 
That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Sweet pea. She Looks like we that. got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. There's no other men, are there? So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. Yeah. We're fine, by the way. <laughs> nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're mm. already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. And that's <laughs> all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We don't have walker problems. We have to go eventually, Lily. It's I know, true. Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? <laughs> Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about There's the us. food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Good everything point. that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. I couldn't let her suffer. We're yeah. all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We True. all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. <laughs> it's true, I'm a man Look, of conscience. Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. It's and true. it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Whoa. Now everybody get out. Who's stealing our supplies? That's not cool. Uh, I don't know what to say. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Who should thank me for putting that poor girl out of her misery? Punk? Getting upset at me? Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, Carly's my favorite. I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. Yep. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Okay. Let's go talk with Lily. Hopefully she's calmed down. Carly's cool. I like Carly. Obviously, Katja has been cool, too. Lily just seems to be going nuts. And, uh... Kenny, we re really need to make it f work with Kenny. He's a good guy. He just, he's just a, he's getting to that point where he'll do whatever it takes too quickly, I think. <laughs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? 
I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do yeah. you know what's going on? I Almost. don't. I just heard you mention it. Things yeah. are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Hmm. For real? Who? Oh, what do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Hmm. Really? Counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. Medicine. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. Hmm. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? <laughs> I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I don't think anybody's doing it. I found this it. tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment. We fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you're using it when you shouldn't. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, I'll poke around. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. Interesting point. A mystery. There you go. Jesus, Doc. We got some. I'm we got sorry. some help. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. <laughs> can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> uh. Sure. <laughs> okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. Good word, good word. It is interesting, though, a broken flashlight. Um. Okay, let's go what's this direction. Nothing is that direction. All right, now we need to have a chat with Carly, who may know something about the disappearances. She did say she wanted to chat with us. And, yeah, there she is. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Ooh. Uh, let's play stupid here. What about? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. What? People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. <laughs> You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. She's probably right. It's good to be honest with people. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. Good point. So you'll do it then? Yeah, I'll tell people. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. I'm always a proponent of telling the truth and being honest. Oh, she kissed me. You'll thank me later. Oh, yeah, I will, baby. <laughs> I like Carly. She's awesome. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. <laughs> and the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? <laughs> Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. That was funny. Uh, Thoughts about Lily. Do you feel safe here? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. <laughs> I don't know. This place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Yeah. That's good enough. look into this thing. Good idea. All right, so Carly's up there. 
now. Oh, Clementine, how you doing? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like <laughs> Putting a bug on his pillow? Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> I love Clementine. She's amazing. That was great. Did you actually put a bug on her on her pillow? Yes. That's great. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's have a chat with, with hey, Kenny. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Hmm. About the guns. Don't you start. Excuse me? I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. Yeah. Now let me talk to Kenny. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? We need to make we need to make this better with Kenny for sure. It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. Oh, we're gonna tell him. We're gonna tell him right now. Here we go. I was uh on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? No. It wasn't. Because we got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? No. Good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Probably a good idea to tell him now. He appreciates my honesty, though. That's good. I wonder if this guy knows anything about the flashlight. The flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. Um, he seems very suspicious, don't you think? Yeah, he seems suspicious, but here's the glass. Where are you going, Lee? Get There's over here. Some broken glass on the ground there. Makes me think that there might be. Maybe we should touch it. <laughs> hmm. Yep, it definitely fits in the the light bulb or the flashlight. Oh crap! There's something drawn there. Well, it's an X, dummy. Not good. Hmm. Duck. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Oh boy. Maybe it's a sign. It is a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. There's no pink. Okay, we need to ask Clementine if she knows anything about some pink chalk. Because I'm pretty sure, if I'm right, yeah, they're not going to know anything about this. Hey, Clem. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. Hmm. She doesn't have it. Somebody stole it. I found something. What is it? 
I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was hmm. calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. Somebody's been here. High five. Cool. There you go. There you go. Scuff. More chalk. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. Somebody's totally been here. Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Good boy. Going outside, it's never, uh... It's a bit dangerous and a bit scary, but you know what? It is what it is. We have to investigate what in the world's going on out here. Let's see. Fence looks fine. Great. There's a grate down there. Interesting. <laughs> oh, crap. There's something in there. There's something in there. Get it! Like a bag of food? What is it? the supplies. Son of a bitch. I know what's happened. Somebody made a deal with those bandits that they would trade supplies instead of getting attacked. That's what happened. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Yep. Okay. We line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? Uh-oh. You don't fucking steal from us! Uh-oh. Who the fuck is that? Yo, We've got our people out there. Now. The bandits are here. We ain't fucking around! Yep. What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit. They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life. Oh, boy. Shit. Okay. So- Enough of this bullshit. She's gonna get Who? up and snipe. Stop putting your boots in these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. Uh... Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we got her! That's why! Hmm. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well... I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up, bro! Christ! Oh, shit! One bandit down, three more to go. <gasps> At least two more. Up! Oh, oh, oh. Up! Up! Shoot him! Shoot! Shoot! Shoot him! I was not fast enough. Oh, crap. Oh, no! Get back there! Smoke him out! Oh! We gotta get out of here! Okay. No shit! Get in the RV. Bastards. Cover our people and get them to the RV! Yeah, get in the RV. Go, 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 go! Uh, push. Yeah, get, get down. There. Missed. I missed! Go, go, go! Yep, right there and right. Yeah, I'm watching you, kid. You know, you're gonna pop up and- Get down, son! Now! Get over here! Hurry! Man, Not the best shooter, but that was awesome. Get inside! Alright, looks like we're leaving sooner than we thought. Oh, Clementine. crap. Clementine! Help! Gotcha! Hang on! Oh, no. Oh, yes! The walkers for the win! I love it when the walkers eat the bad guys. That was awesome. Yes! Get down. Uh, did I? Oh, right here. That's what's up. And then there's another one right. Oh, 
Oh, he's right there. Okay. He's over here. Dang it. Keep an eye on him. Keep an eye on him. Keep an eye on him. Wait, what? Dude just shot me? No, 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 no. That did not just happen. That did not just happen. This guy is going to get it now. Tell me we're not starting over from the beginning of the fight. Okay, we're starting on the right side. There's four of them, it looks like. Hang on! You gotta be quick. You gotta be quick. Oh, wait, never mind. There's three. Get down. I love that walker. That's my favorite walker. He's hiding behind that van. Get your asses around behind. Oop, oop, I missed. Okay, we need to get this guy. Come on. Get down. Get this dude. Get down. And there's one more. Get down. That should be it. Hurry, come oh, on! That one was a lot easier than the first time. Get inside that the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go! Oh! Oh! No! 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 Oh yeah. That's what's up. That's how. I'm getting good at the shooting thing. Lily, get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. No. Come on, Lily. Shit. It's okay. Now we turned into. It went from a. Uh, pull left or right on the left stick to move between shots. What do you mean? Oh. Okay. Oh crap. Okay. 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 Quick. Quick. Oh, I'm a bad shot. There we go. Left, 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 left. Right. There. Okay. Go back to right. This one is gone. Oh, I got everybody. Okay. Whew. This has been a. Uh, this is this has been fun. Last chance. Get down here. Come on, Lily. Come on, Lily. Shit. Lily, come on. We don't have time to wait for you. There we go. Oh, I didn't get to drive the van. <laughs> oh man, guys, we've made our getaway. Oh, that was Cat, scary. Jesus, are you okay? And I think that's a good stopping point. We have made it out. The bandits didn't get our stuff. And, well, actually, I don't even know if we had got our stuff before we were ran out by all the walkers. So, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. Thank you all so much for tuning in. And be sure to look forward to next time where we find out where the heck we're going. It's going to be crazy. But, guys, that's it for me. I love each and every one of you. And, as always, I will see you all again next time.